All right, well, we're up to the third episode, a reel of seven inches. The Western Bay Bank, the museum's new alarm system has recently been installed. Its circuit diagrams are kept safe in this bank vault. Without further ado, let's go ahead and start this mission. We've also got a couple of the new abilities which we'll unlock. The Western Bay Bank. That's where we'll find the circuit diagrams for the alarm system in the Museum of Modern Art. In the main vault. The curator seems to be anticipating thieves. Think he knows Murray? Maybe it's thanks to Murray's connections that the Luna Stone is on exhibition again. The curator might have caught wind of a thing like that. We'll make our way in through the sewage system. I'll take care of the guards. I'll sneak up on them and then pow! Lights out! Easy peasy! They'll be down for the count. Every guard you knock out's gonna wake up with a shiner and be looking to return the favor. What do you think the sneaky songs are for, huh? With these things on, they'll never hear us coming. We've got to watch out for the cameras. If they get us on film, getting busted will only be a matter of time. By manipulating their terminals, we can switch most of them off fairly easy. We can also use camera jammers to distort their signals, for a few seconds at least. Once we're in the vault, teamwork's the name of the game. It will have to move like clockwork, and we'll have to know who's pulling which switch and when. The main vault is protected by guards and under camera surveillance. Be extra careful around the guards. Sometimes they turn around when you least expect it. We'll use the archives for a little game of hide and seek. When we have the circuit diagrams, we need to reach the elevator without being seen, and then we escape over the rooftops. All right, so we can't really select too much of our crew because, well, we've only got two other options and they're the only other two. The, the other three we actually unlock a little bit later on, and there are a couple of things, like I did notice there is an air vent here. So Rocket can cross it using the bar constrictor skill, but we haven't unlocked that yet, so there's obviously that replayability there. Um, I'm not going to go ahead and get anything from the workshop either because you don't really need it for any of these missions. That's one of the best parts of the game. You actually don't need, at least I'm fairly certain, especially for the ladder missions as well. Let's go ahead and start the heist, and we should be pretty Everybody well off. All right, seems like we made it up here through a tunnel in the ground, old Chapo style. Let's go ahead and unpause the game, and we've got six treasures to find as well. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to send this guy up in over here, and he will go ahead and knock that guard out. There are some guards. I'm not sure if it's in this mission, though. Um, yeah, no, in this mission, they're just all normal guards. Uh, but there's some guards that you can't actually knock out. They're like armored guards, and they're much more difficult to go ahead and um, take on. So I'll get this guy to go ahead and clear this door open for us. Hopefully it won't take too long. Then we can go ahead and turn this camera off, which will make everything a lot easier for us as well. Should get there nice and quickly though, hurry up takes how long doesn't actually say but we're gonna come back over here because this guy is gonna be right on our tail very shortly does he it seems like he will turn around here yeah, indeed it does I'll do this now actually no it's probably not the best idea better to be more conservative than not As soon as he starts looking into this elevator, as in right now, there we go, we walk through the door, beautifully done. Because this camera's off now, we can go ahead and into this room and take those heist spoils. And we've got plenty of time. All right, so what else can we do over here? We can come up over into this room with Rocket and she can turn this light barrier off. Very nice. Now to get into this room, we need to turn the switch off. 
Uh, but you can actually, it's probably better to go around this way through the security door, I think, because you only really need to turn this switch off. All right, anyways, um, we need to pay attention to what's happening over here. We're gonna come in over here, and then when this guy, actually, you know what, we could come up over here because this is just a normal door, isn't it? Let's go over here, there we go. Now, do we have the ability? No, we don't have the ability to actually break strong boxes, I remember, all right. And I had the problem because there's no keys here that you can actually break through strong boxes, which is very strange, I must say. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and cancel this guy's moves and just wait up. Oh, yeah, we should be good. This guy doesn't actually look at this door directly. But I'll take these spoils. So I'm not quite sure how we get this strong box. And there's another strong box up over here as well in the vault. Okay, we'll go ahead and uh, come back over here. I guess the only th way that you can do this is by doing, by buying the different um, mechanics or the things from the workshop. Not my field of expertise. All right, this is a okay, a um, switch door. Radio. So now, what's up next? What we've got to do? This is a security door, which opens up security doors, which doesn't really matter because we've got um, Bishop to do the security door stuff for us. Yeah. What I will do though, knock this guy out, and then we'll go straight onto this guy. I'll send Rocket in right over here, quickly. This guy's just gonna wake up any second. You know what, I'll actually send Rocket just to get those keys. Now, when guys get knocked out, they go looking um, in an area where they wouldn't normally. They, he didn't doesn't go in this room because I guess there's already a guy in here, so. He doesn't know that his buddy's knocked out. Actually, what I'm going to have to do is, it's this way over here. What now? So I'm going to have to knock this guy back out again, I think. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want this guy to do this. I want Rocket to come up over here quickly. Where's this guy standing up over here? So we're all good. Now, Rocket opened Ready this door up for our good mate over here. Is this a switch door? It is indeed. Really? And this guy realizes, he's like, what in the world is going on? So what I will do is he's gonna come up over here. So that means he's gonna look through this door. I just better hide a little bit better, like so. All right, so that's that done. I think we can just um, afford to... Well, I need to switch this door. That's what I really need to do. What is the plan? So as soon as this guy's done... Which he is... I'll send Bishop in... To go crack this door. Just gonna make sure this guy doesn't turn around here. Because he would have seen us. Now go ahead and unlock this door. And that means Cleopatra will be able to come through here. It's um, very amazing just the development of this game. Like, it's just the um, structure of the maps. Definitely would have taken so long to actually figure out and get working as perfectly as it is working. All right, so now all these doors are open. I am ready to rock and roll. We'll get... Cleopatra just to run around here. You need to run um, in a circle like uh, the guard is going around in. Now there's a strong box over here. There's a second one that I'm actually not able to go get, but that's life. Now we open up the vault door. 
There we go, and that's the alarm system security diagrams that we need. Get and open this switch up. He's just realized what's happened over there. I'm just going to wait back over here because he's going to come back to his um, normal patrol spot. Actually, we might be able to do this super quickly. I'm going to put him over there. All right, now we're all good. Ready when you are. So I'll get Cleopatra back onto the camera terminals and now we're in a much better position. Yeah, you can make little silly mistakes like that, but no problem was still unnoticed, of course, because... They're none the wiser. Congratulations, you criminal mastermind. Good luck with the circuit diagram. They're top of the line. You'll need them if you're going to get to the lunar stone before I do. Give it the old college try. But I practically invented this game. If you fail, I have friends in high places who can pull a few strings for you. You'll have an extra speedy trial with a free pass straight to San Quentin. So here's to the good old thieves code. Let the games begin. Murray! That... Indeed. I knew that was too easy. Come on, boys. Let's get a move on. We can complain later. Yeah, all right. So I'll just quickly pause it. So there's literally no way that I know of that you can actually go ahead and break those strong boxes. Uh, there's no keys or anything. So I think you definitely need to bring in supplies beforehand. All you need um, to do it with Bishop later on when he has the ability to break all the strong boxes. All right, so it seems like this guy's back onto his patrol. Wait a second. Ah, uh, no, he's. All right. We're all good. So now all we have to do is escape, really. So what I'm going to do is send both Bishop. And Cleopatra up over here. Um, yeah, I'll leave them there. All right, now you knock your guy out, and you can come up over here. Shoot, I don't know if I should have been doing that right away this guy's checking out what's happening over there yeah. uh, oh no 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 so when the guard this guard comes out looking over here okay that's not a good idea because he, he looks straight into the elevator ready to serve gonna have to wait it out a little bit more He's none the wiser. We've got no clue. This guy's going back to his door. Yes. I'll send these two in over here. All right, and now we'll be able to make it. So I'm able to send Rufus. Is that his name? It is indeed. In over here. Yes. Uh, let's just make sure these guys aren't going to be within range, and they won't be. And then we'll send Cleopatra in over here, and that should be mission complete. We've escaped by using the customer's elevator. Thankfully, we did that unnoticed as well, so we should get a fairly high score. 10 minutes, 20 seconds. Didn't get two of the strong boxes, unfortunately. But we got the maximum stealth score, which is always nice, and a new best crook score. We've got the new skill for Bishop, which he unlocks the strong box. I knew something like this would happen. The Luna Stone cannot fall into his hands. Not again. Not Murray. He knows us. He knows how we work. He's probably already tipped off the cops that were staking out the museum. Ha! To the thieves' code. He would say something like that. At least we know that he hasn't manipulated the diagrams. 
and that he's keeping a close eye on us. If we keep this up, he'll always be a step ahead of us. We need to focus. We have to outsmart him somehow. Go off the grid! Well, maybe Don Cesare can help us. Again? Flamingo's place was more than a small favor already. He may not be done with Murray yet, but his help will most definitely come with a price. Yeah, he's got plenty of enemies. I'm sure there's something we can do for him. Let's ask him. It's not like we'll have to bump off somebody. All right. Well, that was a reel of seven inches. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that episode as much as I did. We'll be back for mail for the snowman very shortly.